Next number, number 41. If a traffic is terminated after 45 minutes of usage, how much is the traffic? The traffic in Erlang, of course, na sa unit natin, letter A to D, units are in Erlangs. Okay? So, how do we compute for the Erlang? Erlang, or the telephone traffic, is equal to the, the, <laughs> the number of... Uh, uh, or the number of calls, that is C, the number of calls, multiplied by the time or the, the duration of call in a busy hour. Okay? So, ilan ba yung call? Ang sabi rito, if a call, meaning isa lang yung call. So, ang number of calls mo is 1, and then ang uh, duration mo, call duration is 45 minutes. If we're going to convert that in an hour, that will be like this. Okay, so one call, and then one call, 45 minutes in a BC hour. So 45 divided by 60, that's converting the minutes into hour to make it a call hour. Okay, so pagka uh, ginawa natin ito, this will be... This will give us a 0.75 Erlang uh, product. Okay, so the the answer for number 31 is letter C, 0.75 Erlang. Question number 32. An angstrom used to describe a light wave is equal to 10 raised to minus blank micrometer. Now take note, this is micrometer, hindi siya meter. No? Kasi kung meter yan, that will be 10 raised to minus 10. Okay, but since this is micrometer, that will be 10 raised to minus, minus 4. The answer is letter D, 4. Okay, that's number 32. Question number 33. In a Yagi antenna, the, re the director is place the director is place blank the driven element. Nasaan siya, nasaan yung director with respect to the driven element? That will be what? In front, above, below, or behind? Well, pagka tinignan mo kasi yung Yagi antenna, ang, ang pinaka-basis natin, of course, is the driven element. And right in front of it is the director. Okay. Yung reflector naman is behind, not above, not below, but it is in front, that is the director, and the reflector is behind. So letter A is for number 23. Question number 34. A method of pulse modulation where the position of a constant with pulse within a prescribed time slot is varied according to the amplitude of the sample of the analog signal. So, nagkakaroon tayo ng uh, constant width pulse, okay? Pero within a prescribed time slot. Anong tawag natin sa pulse modulation na yun? We have four. Pulse amplitude, pulse uh, duration, or that is also the pulse uh, position. We have the pulse width and, of course, the pulse code modulation. Okay, so ano ba yung tinutukoy natin dito? Ang tinutukoy natin dito na type of pulse modulation is the pulse position modulation. Ang keyword dito is the time slot, the prescribed time slot. Okay? Question number 35. What is the minimum Nyquist sample rate with a maximum audio input frequency of 4 kHz? Napakadali na na ito, no? Kasi dati na natin itong sinasolve. Pero baka sakali, Ito yung mga lalabas sa board exams. Okay? So, madali lang naman siya isolve. Tama? FS or the minimum uh, Nyquist sample rate is greater than or equal to twice of the analog frequency. And the analog input frequency is given at 4 kHz. So, that will be 2 times 4 kHz. The answer will be 8. And that is letter C. For number 35, letter C. Okay? Next number. Question number 36. Who invented PCM in 1937? Absolutely not Tim, Tim Berners-Lee. No, he's not the one. 
and not Carol Capek. Carol Capek is involved in robotics. Dalawa na lang. Alex Reeves or Arthur Clark? Arthur Clark is in satellite. So Alex Reeves is the one who invented PCM. Pwede niyong sagutan yung mga tanong in that way by uh, by uh, elimination, method of elimination. Number 36, letter B. Number 37, the slope of the analog signal is greater than the delta modulator can maintain. This is called, ito yun na i-discuss ko na rin sa inyo last time doon sa ating TRS. If you still remember, if you have an analog input, for example, in, in this manner. Okay, so ano nangyayari? Nagkakaroon tayo ng uh, conversion sa digital. Pero ang nangyayari, because of the slope of the analog signal which is steep, ito yung conversion sa digital before transmission. Ito yung equivalent niya sa digital. So pagdating ng reception, pagdating sa receiver, what will happen? Mangyayari ngayon, yung slope niya is not anymore the same as the slope of the original analog signal. When this happens, anong tawag natin doon sa uh, scenario na yun? Ang tawag natin doon is basically a slope overload. And that is letter C for number 37. Okay, Number 38, it is the transmission of information from one or more source to one or more destination over the same transmission medium. So this is a sharing a transmission medium from one or more source to one or more destination. So napakandali lang ng sagot. No? Ang tawag natin ay multiplexing for number 38. Number 39, which of the following is an advantage? Is a an advantage of wavelength division multiplexing? Wavelength division multiplexing, by the way, is used in fiber optics. This is the multiplexing used in fiber. Okay? Ano ba ang advantage niya or advantages because we have any of these option? Enhanced capacity. Full duplex transmission is also possible with a single fiber. Inherently easier to configure. Are these advantages of WDM or only one of these is an advantage? The answer is any of these, letter D. So, pakitandaan nyo na po yung tatlong yan. Hopefully, sa board exam, lumabas yan. Question number 40. What is the characteristic impedance for an RG59A uses polyethylene as dielectric coaxial cable with the following specification? Inner conductor diameter 0 0.025 inches. Outer conductor diameter of 0.15 inch. Okay. So, paano ang pag-compute nito? Madali lang ito, no? Ang formula na gagamitin natin, of course, is ZO equals 138 over square root of the relative permittivity log of the outer diameter, that's the uh, capital D, and small d is the diameter of the inner conductor. Okay? So, substitute natin yung mga, mga formula. Uh, mga, I mean the, the values to the formula. The relative permittivity for the polyethylene material is 2.3. Okay? So completing the equation, that will be the complete uh, values for the equation. And using your calculator solving for the characteristic impedance, that would be 71.9 ohms. And of course, that is letter B. Okay? 